Hey there viewers, let's talk about vitamins for a few minutes. There are so many different kinds out there. Each has a different effect on your body. Let's talk about the vitamins that help your skin. I mean, summer's just around the corner. You want healthy skin if you're going to hang outside. We'll go through the usual suspects like vitamin C and D. But how much do you know about vitamin E? Which vitamin protects your skin from aging? Wait, is there actually a vitamin F? We're talking about all that and more. Number 1. Vitamin E We don't talk about vitamin E enough. It's one of the lesser appreciated vitamins out there. Well, I'm here to change that, folks. Vitamin E is an essential nutrient that fights inflammation, and it's one your skin desperately needs. Not only will it strengthen your immune system, vitamin E also contains antioxidants that protects your skin from damage. When your skin is exposed to harmful particles, whether it's UV light, smoke, or air pollution, it produces free radicals. The free radicals work to damage your collagen. This is the type of protein that maintains the tissues of not just the skin, but also the muscles, ligaments, and tendons. Your DNA and skin cells will also be damaged. This turns it really wrinkly. You sometimes look older than you actually are. When you consume vitamin E, it helps fight back and neutralize the free radicals. When UV light hits the skin, it's said that it can decrease your vitamin E levels by as much as half. So, what do you eat to get it? There are plenty of foods you can eat to get vitamin E. On one hand, you have veggies like asparagus, spinach, and collard greens. You can also find vitamin E in foods like mango, avocado, almonds, and sunflower seeds. There are so many delicious things to choose from. Just make sure that whatever you're eating, you're getting more than 15 milligrams per day. What's your favorite way to get vitamin E? Are you a veggie person? Maybe you like eating simple almonds? Sound off in the comments section and start a conversation with our bestie community. Number 2. Vitamin B Vitamin B refers to a group of vitamins rather than a single one. A group of eight to be exact. There's vitamin B1, B2, B3, B5, B6, B7, B9, and B12. I mean, it gets pretty confusing. Each has their own really scientific name and it's really hard to pronounce. The reason I'm mentioning B vitamins is because they can do a lot for your skin. All right, I'm going to have to get into one of those scientific names. I promise it's just gonna be once. You ready? Let's talk about niacinamide for a second. Not too hard, right? Also known as vitamin B3, niacinamide is essential for skincare products. It helps to maintain the normal barrier function of your skin while reducing symptoms of eczema. What it does is increase your level of lipids. These are the molecules that make up the building blocks of your cells. When vitamin B3 is consumed, it moisturizes the skin. This reduces the appearance of pores, dark spots, pigmentation, redness, wrinkles, and lines. If you're aiming for healthier skin, a vitamin B deficiency is not something you want. Not getting enough will cause your skin to crack and become wrinkled. A B deficiency will also make your skin a lot more sensitive to sunlight and personal care products. You'll notice a lot more redness than normal. If you're looking for vitamin B in your diet, you are in luck. Vitamin B can be found in lots of meats including chicken breast, pork, ground beef, and turkey. You've also got liver, tuna, and salmon. Number 3. Vitamin D Ah yes, the famous nutrient nobody gets enough of. Vitamin D is known for a lot of good things. For one, it strengthens your immune system while making your teeth, bones, and muscles stronger. But do you know about how it protects your skin? Well, there's a reason vitamin D is known as the sunshine vitamin. I mean, sure, you can take supplements, but vitamin D is absorbed naturally through simply spending time under the sun. During each day at the beach, your skin will produce vitamin D as a reaction to the sunlight. Vitamin D contributes to the growth of your skin cells. Much like vitamin E, this works to destroy the free radicals affecting your skin. Pretty cool, right? Well, given how easy it is to get vitamin D, so many people suffer from deficiencies. Did you know close to 30% of Canadians have lower than usual vitamin D levels? About 40% are below the cutoff in the wintertime. At the same time, about 42% of American adults have low vitamin D. Due to the pandemic lockdowns, these stats have probably gotten even worse. The same research has shown that females have a higher concentration of vitamin D in their blood than males. The worst is when you're living in a place with not a lot of sun. If you're trying to increase your vitamin D, there are other options aside from hanging outdoors. For one, you can try vitamin D supplements. Experts suggest a daily average of 400 to 800 international units. That's around 10 to 20 micrograms. There are also plenty of foods you can add to your diet, ones with quite a bit of vitamin D. 
I mean, red meats are actually a pretty good source. But you also have things like salmon, sardines, mackerel, liver, and egg yolk. Moving on. But before we continue, are you looking to get in better shape? You need to make sure your organs are functioning properly. Check out our recent video discussing 9 foods that'll make your liver stronger. Number 4. Vitamin C We talked about collagen a little earlier, right? Well, it's time to bring it back. Vitamin C carries antioxidants that boost your collagen production. This nutrient will go to war against free radicals and repair damage done to your skin cells. A damaged skin cell will only increase wrinkles and reinforce signs of aging. Outside of taking your vitamins, you have things like broccoli, Brussels sprouts, and potatoes. Perhaps the most famous source of vitamin C is orange. You also have fruits like strawberries. Who doesn't like some sweet strawberries during the summer season? I mean, where's the fun without them? Number 5. Vitamin A This is probably the most powerful skin-protecting vitamin. Also known as retinol, vitamin A is so effective it can actually change the appearance of your skin's surface. Vitamin A binds with the receptors in your skin cells. This protects the collagen from decreasing and strengthens the skin altogether. You see, there are two types of vitamin A, retinoids and carotenoids. Both are processed through the liver to make retinol. Once this happens, it's transmitted over to your cells for repair. If this doesn't happen, your skin will just become really dry. Let's talk about keratin for a second. This is an important type of protein that protects your cell's strength. Vitamin A deficiency will also result in something called hyperkeratosis. This is when there's just too much keratin in your hair follicles, causing your skin to form papules. Papules are tiny raised areas of skin tissue. If you want vitamin A from your diet, eggs are delicious. There's also broccoli, spinach, and leafy greens. Are you into trying skim milk? There's also that option as well. Number 6. Vitamin F I teased this one a little earlier. Yes, vitamin F exists, and it's not talked about nearly as much as it should be. Well, to be honest, it's not a vitamin in the way others are. I know I promised it would just be the one time, but we're going to get scientific again. You ready? Vitamin F is a name given to two separate fats. There's lyolinic acid and alpha-lyolinic acid. The F stands for fatty acid. Pretty creative, am I right? Vitamin F provides your body with structure. Outside of helping your body perform its usual functions, vitamin F helps to repair damaged cells. When it comes to your skin, vitamin F will protect your skin barrier while keeping the skin smooth. Hey, we haven't talked about acne yet. There's also reason to believe that vitamin F can help people with pimple problems. A study from back in 2010 showed that people who applied lyolinic acid to their faces saw less acne. This, of course, was for people with mild acne. If you're suffering from a severe case, you need to do a little more than just apply fatty acids. Sorry, vitamins aren't just good for your skin, they're essential for your body to function. Have I sparked your interest? Let's keep the conversation going with a few more vitamin videos, shall we? Check out the ultimate guide to every vitamin your body's starving for. Or how about 9 warning signs your body's missing vitamin E? Go ahead and click one, or better yet, watch both, and learn more about how to make your body healthier. Have you been getting the proper vitamins for your skin? Let us know in the comments below.